Russia and Bush took down four Ukrainian armored vehicles in an attempt to break the siege in Bakhmut. A military convoy of many Ukrainian armored vehicles suffered serious losses in an attempt to break the siege in the city of Bakhmut. The Ukraine Weapons Tracker page has posted pictures of a Ukrainian military convoy suffering serious damage after entering a Russian ambush in an attempt to break the siege in the Bakhmut fire pan, eastern this country. According to some sources, at least nine BMP-1 IFV armored personnel carriers of the Ukrainian army participated in the relief plan in the area of the village of Berkovka, a northern suburb of the city of Bakhmut. This military convoy was later detected by a Russian surveillance unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV. Russian artillery then opened fire and destroyed at least four Ukrainian armored vehicles. Also on March 6, Lt. Gen. Igor Konishenkov, a spokesman for the Russian Defense Ministry, announced that the Russian army had carried out several raids, causing heavy damage to Ukraine in the past 24 hours. According to Gen. Konishenkov, the Russian military destroyed a Bukem-1 air defense complex, a radar station of the S-300 air defense complex and a counter-reaction radar station produced by the U.S. and dated to Ukraine. In the settlement of Troitsky in the Donetsk People's Republic, a Ukrainian self-propelled anti-aircraft missile system Bukem-1 was destroyed. Also in Donetsk, the Russian military hit a radar guidance station of the complex, Ukraine's S-300 anti-aircraft missile. In addition, an American anti-aircraft radar and slash TPQ-37 was also destroyed in the settlement of Gulyaypol in the Zaporizhia region, a spokesman for the Russian Defense Ministry said. Lt. Gen. Konishenkov also confirmed that the fighter jets of the Russian Air Force, in coordination with the Air Defense Forces, shot down three Ukrainian planes in the past 24 hours. Our fighters shot down a Su-27 fighter of the Ukrainian Air Force during a dogfight in the Trudulanovka area in Zaporizhia. In addition, an enemy Mi-8 helicopter was also shot down crashed near the settlement of Novopavlovka in Donetsk. Also in Donetsk, the Russian air defenses knocked out a Ukrainian MiG-29 fighter jet near the city of Krasnodarsk, Konishenkov revealed. At the Krasny Liman front, intense fighting is also taking place between the two factions of Russia and Ukraine. According to the Russian military, in the past day, the Ukrainian defense forces have lost 160 soldiers a tank, five infantry fighting vehicles, three military vehicles and a grad rocket launcher. An ammunition depot belonging to the 55th Artillery Brigade of Ukraine was also destroyed in the settlement of Doknoi in Donetsk. The Russian Defense Ministry has not yet commented on the information.